Hi and welcome to Smart Learners video. In this video we're going to be covering stopping distances and a little trick on how to remember them. Okay, so as you can see here all the stopping distances are listed. Now the start of this rule is quite simple. The one that we want to remember is that 70 miles per hour equals 96 meters, okay? So this is the one that we're going to want to remember. Now do you notice anything about the rest of this? There's an actually a little formula that you can use, okay? So what's the difference between 70 and 60? Well, it'd be minus 10. 70 minus 10 is obviously 60 miles per hour. Now, also on this side, it'd be minus 20, because the difference is 20. Now, the interesting thing with this is this rule can be repeated. So 60 minus 10 is 50 miles per hour. And then we can also come over here and do 73 meters down to 53 meters. And you can repeat this rule all the way down to 40 miles per hour. Now this rule does only work for the values between 70 and 40 miles per hour, but it's extremely helpful on getting you to remember these base values for your theory test. Now what I will say is that obviously we're not being exact here. 96 minus 20 is obviously not 73. However, in the theory exam, they won't give you 51, 52, 53, and 54. They'll be giving you values that are some distance apart. So this rule is very helpful if you're just struggling with stopping distances and just want to learn them for your theory exam.